What's up YouTube, Multiapolis here with another video, and today we're going to be playing a little bit of Call of Duty Zombies. We're just going to play Farm, and I think we're just going to play a game, actually. Let's see what my personal best for Farm is. It is currently round 17 with 441 kills. So yeah, that's good. So we will see if we can beat that record. Hopefully we can. I'll just be recording one video. So, I don't know how long this will be. Alright, box is in there. So we're actually going to get uh, enough points to unlock the door. And then, um, eventually get enough points to... Um... By quick revive. Yeah, yeah, we've already started this game, which is good. We should have enough to get uh to five hundred points at the end of this round. We'll see. I don't exactly want to kill a zombie, uh in the lava. So. Try and avoid that at, at all costs. So another kill. And we would have. Got enough points. Or we should. Okay good. <clears throat> I, I actually love. Uh, uh, farm and town. Those are my two favorite maps. In terms of green run, along with transit, I'm not a big fan of bus depots solely because of the fact that there are no perks there. But I do love the fact that they made it diff that Treyarch could, um, Treyarch and Activision, uh, made those are like Activision owns Treyarch, Treyarch, and Treyarch is the studios that um, they made Call of Duty Black Ops. So, but either way, I'm glad. That uh, they made Bus Depot difficult, which makes it more fun, to be honest. Alright, and one more knife. So it looks like, unless we can build up a couple of. Let me mute my mic and turn on game volume.
You know what? We're gonna play more than one game, so... Give me a moment to look up, or uh, to pause, and get back my OBS. Uh, to make sure I'm not... The game isn't somehow lagging, even though I'm recording it. Okay, normally I'd buy a... Another perk, but I want to make sure I can I can get the MP5 as a backup weapon instead of the M1911. So we're gonna open up the next door, the last door you have to open up, and then we will start getting our perks. Oh, I, I felt that we went over a... Uh, it was kind of a little BS when we went down earlier. That's, that's just me. So. Yeah. Let's go ahead and try and grab the insta killing. Oh, we can get a perk now. Okay, that's good. Actually, we are going to get a uh, juggernaut instead of a uh, double tap root beer. Alright, we're gonna get Speed Cola net, or we're gonna get Double Tap next. And then we're gonna get Speed Cola. I think I'm gonna do Buzz Depot after this. I'm gonna do, we're gonna play Buzz Depot and then maybe Die Rise afterwards. Well, we are about to be trapped if we didn't get out there early enough. Okay, let's actually get a uh, speed cola instead of double tap. Actually, yeah, we just had to um, reload right there. And right now, I need to grab some ammo for 
the MP5 because I'm out of ammo for both weapons and that is not good when you're playing zombies. I personally I just prefer using wall weapons over weapons out of the box but to be honest when it comes to bus depot you do not have much of a choice. We're gonna go ahead and grab double tap actually or stamina up I guess not double tap. Right now, we're going to be over here waiting for Max Ammo to use the RPD. We don't even have enough ammo to hit the... We don't even have enough points to hit the box. Uh, if we don't have enough for a uh, speed caller, then I'm going to hit the box. Because we'll just be able to earn it back next round. Alright, we're good. For, we're good in here for a little bit. Now we're not. So after this, it'll be Bus Depot, then Die Rise. For a somewhat long video, depending on how long it lasts. Although it may not be a long video. I don't know. Right, we're, we're lucky to have gotten the max ammo there. Otherwise, we would not be able to get speed cola. So, uh, we're gonna save up money, but at the same time, we are gonna, um... I'm not sure whether I wanna save up money or go find the, uh... Or try... Save up money to pack, or... Let me go ahead and hit my seat. Or if I should, <clears throat> um... Try to get monkeys out of the box. I think we'll save up enough to pack the RPD. Just because I don't want the MP5 to actually um get packed, because we'd have to save up a lot of money for that to actually pay for it. Um, so far, so good. I'll be running over here. I usually camp all the way to up there and back to where we were, where Quick Revive is. From basically Juggernaut, to, or from Quick Revive to Juggernaut. That's where I usually camp. Alright, within the next couple of rounds, we are actually going to... We should have enough to pack. Maybe next round. Looks like. That's good. We should be about a kill away from... Pack, uh, get pack a punching. So we're gonna do that when there are a few zombies left. I do hate how uh they put pack a punch in the middle of the of the lava. So yeah, we should definitely we definitely have enough to pack a punch no matter what at the end of this round. Oh, shoot, we went down. That's not good. That's our second down. That seems to be like a fair down, in my opinion. Solely because of the fact that... We did get trapped. I cannot get hit, otherwise it's game over. Let's go ahead and pack. Uh, let's pack next round. Let's have to get quick revive. Let's 
go ahead and hit the box as well. Oh, yes, the hammer. This is even, in my opinion, it's better than the RPD. The only thing I don't like about the RPD is the fact that it takes so long to reload. How did we get down? The zombie was there. I did not notice the zombie. I should have, but I didn't notice it. We are out of quick revive, so we may not even pack a punch. The one thing I hate about Call of Duty Black Ops 2 is you lose all your perks when you get down. And then we died, so we were unfortunately not able to pack a bunch. So yeah, let's go ahead and play a little bit of Bus Depot and then um, Die Rise. Alright, that wasn't bad. Could have been worse. Not not transit. We've done transit before. We're just gonna do a bus depot. Let's see. The farthest I've ever made on one player for bus depot is round ten. Okay. That should be a fun challenge to actually try on a beat to see if we can get to round eleven. So there are no perks here, so once we get down, that is it. Huh. You see the donkey. Then it says restrooms right there. Let's go ahead and throw out a grenade. Should kill about half the zombies. That's good. Oh, there are two zombies right here. I love transit. We're, we're no longer earning money from uh, rebuilding that. All right, there are also, we cannot pack a punch as well. You know, that's technically a perk, so that should have been obvious. I love like, a good strategy a good strategy is to have like around here. But I don't know. Alright, we need to get to about nine hundred we actually do need to get to nine hundred and fifty. In order to uh You know, to avoid possibly getting a bad weapon, we're actually going to buy the MP5 first. It's going to just kill the zombie. Get it out of the way. Okay, that's the end of the round. It's been a while since I played Bus Depot. If my memory serves me correct, it's been a while. I think my favorite map to play by myself for Call of Duty Black Ops 2 Zombies is Buried. I love playing that by myself. I love playing Mob of the Dead. Um, by myself. Die Rise is okay. So basically, I like playing by myself. Farm, Bus Depot, or no, not Bus Depot. Uh, it's Farm, Town, Transit, Mob of the Dead, and um, Buried by myself. Nuketown is uh, Nuketown is like Bus Depot. I don't mind playing it, but I prefer I prefer to play with people. Than by myself. I don't. So yeah.
Let's go to get started with round four. So after this round, we will be about halfway there in terms of tying my record in terms of rounds. All right, let's hit let's hit up the box when we can. All right. Oh, and uh, after this next kill, we or we, if we get to nine fifty here, never mind. We're gonna hit up the box because I do not like the FAL. The cap 40 is okay. It's not the best. In terms of actually, you know, in terms of pistols in Call of Duty Black Ops 2, it is the sec. I think it is the best pistol. In terms of pack a punch uh, pistols, I'd have to go with um the starter weapons pack a punch. Then they call the Mustang and Sally when it's back a punched. Dang it, my controller died. I'm about to go down here. Never mind. Never uh, nah, never mind that. My controller. The one thing I hate about Call of Duty Black Ops 2 is the fact that when your controller dies, it doesn't pause the game for you. And I feel like it should. So we are moving on to Die Rise next. What's my best for Die Rise by myself? Round 13, 243 kills. Okay. Let's go ahead and get started. I have 423,381 kills. That's a lot. Like I mentioned, the furthest I've ever made is buried around 40. That's on any Call of Duty map in every Call of Duty Zombies game, not just Black Ops 2. If I, if I had a mic, I'd play with more people. If I had a mic for the Xbox 360, I would definitely be playing with more people. So, yeah. Here, we're, we're, we're just going to get, um... Um, the... Uh, quick revive. Yeah, we're gonna get quick revive next. First. Okay, I really need to get some batteries. Oh shoot! Oh, well, that. No, let's let's run back. Let's play one more time. Let me show you for a fact that I hit, uh, no, that's my of the dead. Have I made it into round 30 or higher? On 27 or three people? No. Buried round 40. Boom. By myself. Origins. Have I made it into the 30s with Origins? No. So Buried for sure is the only map I made it to round 30 or higher, let alone round 40.
Why my PS Vita charge really quick? And again, it must have been near full battery. So I will pause. I'll go ahead and start the game in a minute. I just need to plug in my laptop. I'd play this if I wouldn't get a cop copyright strike or have it blocked. Okay. I just need to pull out my charger wherever it is in my back. Here it is. Okay, and let's plug it in. It's plugged in. Let's go ahead and get started. We failed on die. I failed on die rise. And boom, we open up the first door rather quickly. And then again, we open up, or uh, we did that. So we need another kill in order to, which ironic would be the last kill. We need to get that, so, and then we can actually, a quick revive. The M114, no thank you. There's the zombie. All right, we actually have over a thousand, so I'm gonna, uh, starting after this run, I'm gonna buy a weapon. So I'm gonna go ahead and buy a right. No. 750. 520. Okay, good. So maybe next round I should buy. Here it is. So, uh. PDW is a thousand. We're gonna save up for a thousand and get the PDW. Just because it's gonna be a while before we go ahead and get another weapon. Because I do not plan on going to the box anytime soon. So, if you wanna play Call of Duty Zombies with me, um. P oh, we went down here. Dang it. That's my fault. Feel free to let me know at what your gamer tag is and I will add you. No, 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 dang it, dang it, da oh shoot, never mind. Let's run it back again, but I'm gonna switch out my batteries now. This time we're not going to get quick revive just because of the fact that I want to, at least there's a weapon you can build and I want to get that weapon. We're at 423,902 blah, blah. kills. So, so far, so good. Give it a moment. Oh. 
Oh, yes, we made it up here. It's gonna be 750 to open up this door. Make sure that. Let's try to build the weapon as usual. Well, first off. So we will need to open up both doors. So it's gonna take a couple of rounds. So. Shoot, I remember we need to uh, also open up the second part. Uh, we would need to open up down there, which is at least a thousand. Shoot. We'll open that up next. Screw it, we can just take something out of the bank. Turn on power. Rebuild a barrier and then we or kill a zombie and then we can actually open up the next one. So let me make sure there isn't a part over here. There it is, okay. I actually got a... Uh, Pack a punch right there. All right, that's good. Second part, and we're gonna reach up to upstairs to get the third part. And find the rest of the weapon if there are any more parts. Which I think there should be. And we're gonna throw out a grenade. That somehow did not kill all the zombies, but oh well. Conveniently, I got that double points. When there's only probably one or two zombies left. And I was being a little bit sarcastic because, uh. There should be another part over here. Somewhere. Additional parts required. Okay, here's the fourth part. No, we built it, but we didn't get to use it. Shoot. Oh, well. Let's go do it again. Ah. Uh, I'll just link to someone using the slick with fire in the next, in the video, in the comment section. Sorry.